Oh, God. Oh, curiosity, what have you done to me now? This here, or at least the sum of its parts, is a Ruger Mark III semi-automatic pistol. Or it was a Mark III. Hopefully I don't have to put it in past tense like that. Curiosity gets the best of you sometimes. Sometimes a field strip just isn't enough. Next thing you know, your well-functioning pistol is completely disabled and detailed stripped. Right down to the receiver. Sure, I'm supposing you could take it apart even further to some ridiculous level, but don't see any need to go that far. And I guess since we have it apart, assuming I can get it back together, we'll go ahead and take the opportunity to drop in one of these Volkortsen target sears. Uh, I didn't go with the whole accurizing trigger kit for 90, 100 bucks. From what I read, the sear is the most important part of improving that trigger pull. So we're going we're gonna to just try to drop a sear in there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. I haven't taken that part out yet, but that down in there is the sear. Maybe we can get some light. Yeah, that's the sear. Just barely. You can see it. That silver there, right there where my thumb is. But anyway, we're going to try to replace that. We may try to disable the lovely magazine safety. Here's the fire control group, right? And this little beak, this evil little beaked guy there, that's the magazine safety. Everybody loves that thing, right? So, I don't know, depending on the mood and how things go, we might we might try to uh, do a little hack on that with some washers. And then we'll try to put Humpty Dumpty back together again. We got a, a rail there, a little $30 red dot. These are Hogue grips. Aftermarket, obviously. We'll put those back on. And, uh... Try to put Humpty Dumpty back together again. Wish me luck.